I have to tell y'all something. We got Duncan from Georgia. I'm in Ohio. We got Bucky from Kentucky. I'm in Ohio. If I have extra meat, put it in the freezer. I got extra meat in the freezer. We ain't never done that before. Pizza for breakfast is crazy, but here we is, girl. Mm -hmm. I love a good baby bird. <laughs> so I'm good. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Make sure nothing ain't in the oven. Girl, you don't even use the oven quickly. Y'all just wiping her down. Ooh, I didn't realize how dusty you were. Oh, it's, I'm baffled. Look at me. I'm trying to use bigger words, child. It's changing colors now, <laughs> Jasmine. <laughs> At this point, I'm just playing in the kitchen. And he showed up when he showed out. I think that's the most talking I did it all year, honey. It's gonna be $35. Do your grandmother perhaps live in a small town? I've been getting that little wash. I've been getting that little wash. I need to go big. So what you about to do, Jess? I don't know. I haven't gotten that far in my thinking process. Hello, good people. Hello. We are now at home. Y'all, I'm debating if I want to go to work today or not. Today, where's my phone? Okay, today is October. I was about to say, uh, go back up, October 29th. Today's October 29th. And I was thinking, <sighs> what would you think, girl? First of all, I ain't been to work ever since the last Tuesday. And today is Tuesday. So I've been, if I take today off, I'll be off for seven days straight. But you guys know I just got back from traveling. I had so much fun with my family. Y'all, it was like, I, I vlogged a little bit, but not too much. I just wanted to be so present. And, like, it was so cool. We played this game. And, okay, let me tell y'all something I did. And then we'll get, like, into that. But, so, I pray. Well, while we talking, let's actually get the sheets. This pizza on the road. Because I am hungry. Um, pizza for breakfast is crazy. But, here we is, girl. Um, I'm not really supposed to have the tomatoes. But, that should be all right, I hope. Cheese that melts like dairy, they say. Stop playing with them folks. Okay, let me see. I can go ahead and do the preheating. Preheat to 450. Make sure nothing ain't in the oven. Girl, you don't even use the oven quickly. Preheat. Okay, so it's gonna get big. Okay, so we're gonna preheat that and then it says remove or replace it, place frozen pizza directly on middle rack, bake for bake pizza for 16 to 18 minutes or until crust is golden and brown and no longer floppy, check pizza after 16 minutes. And it also give you directions on how to make this in the air fryer. Child, they got, they got, all, they showing at the bottom all the other pieces that they got. I didn't see the Supreme one in there. The Supreme dairy free one. They got the melted cheese, like the sliced cheese that I bought. They got some some also mozzarella, look like block cheese. But yeah. All right, Daya, we love that. But anyway, so yes, yeah, so I uh, on my way there, I was praying. I was like, God, I just want to be able to um, have my family just be open and honest. Like, how can we do that? How can we do that? And I, I kept praying. I said, God, please allow the Holy Spirit to be in me and to use me this weekend where me and my family can come together. We can just, like, talk about whatever. Sorry if y'all leaning a bit. My, uh, I can't really tell, like, with this. You know. But, yeah, so I was like, oop, now y'all leaning the other way. It's okay. But, yeah, um. So I just want us to be open and honest. And then I don't know where I came up with this game while we were sitting at the table. And I said popcorn. Out of all things. <laughs> I was like popcorn. And it was like, is this a real game? And I was like, yes. I was like, in order for you to play, you have to be open. You have to be honest. If you cannot be open and honest, you cannot play. The questions will get deep. And you have to answer that question. But if you feel as if you cannot answer the question, then you just back away from the conversation. And we did it and everyone was so open and so honest i've learned so much about my siblings about my grandmother my cousin like it was amazing it was so good it was so good and i and i prayed and i was like god i just like on the way home god thank you thank you god we did it thank you god and i, and I tell you if you really go to god about everything Everything he gonna show up 
it might be the smallest thing. God, you think I need to wear this hoodie today? Girl, God, and you hear guys say, yeah, you wear that hoodie, guess what? It rained or whatever. You know, you in the department where the wind is blowing real bad. It be the little things like just stop and pause for a second. You ain't got, I mean, it ain't got to be every little thing, but most things, you know what I'm saying? When it comes to things like that, I was like, ooh, God, I need you with this one. Like, I need you for this one. And he showed up and he showed out. He's so good. My God is so good, y'all. So good. But I had so much fun. Um, let me get these things because I'm thinking about them. On my way back, I had stopped at Bucky's. And I had got me some of these. And then I also had got um, br a brisket sandwich. I like to eat these like it's cereal. Like pour them in a bowl, put some milk over it, eat it like it's cereal. So I'm good. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. But I'm back home. I eat that pizza. I had some green juice. I poured the green juice in here before I left to go because I had to run some errands real quick. Before I left, I poured the green juice in here and forgot to grab it. I get in the car, say, Jess, you forgot your juice. Girl. But I'm so excited that I did this other thing. Oh, y'all, I fell off on my, um, my, uh, my workout. I only did one workout. And I was supposed to do a workout on I was supposed to do a workout on Thursday and Saturday. I only did a workout on Friday. I was like, you're wrong for that. Man words. I already washed my hands. I used to rush them before I came to the camera. But um so yeah. So I did one thing I did was consistent with drinking something green or putting something green in my mouth every single day. First day on the way down, I had celery juice from traders. Um, second day, the next morning, I, right after I did my workout, which was Friday. Wow, this roast is really so good. I love a good baby bird. That's <laughs> it. But, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, so. Okay, but, so Friday, I went to Smoothie King. And I saw that they had like this veggie protein drink. Got it. Saturday before. Saturday morning actually. Yeah. Saturday morning I got up. Went back over there again. Got another one. Sunday. My cousins they wanted to go get boba and stuff. So I was like okay cool. I'll go with y'all. Whatever. Um, both the, at the boba spot all they had was whole milk. Not going to do the dairy. Quit playing with me. Um, so they had a smoothie king literally right down. Like on the sink. That was like a little plaza strip. It was smoothie king right there. Went there, got my got the same exact smoothie again. So good. And then we, what was Monday? Monday was yesterday. Monday was yesterday. Did I have anything green yesterday? I didn't. Because I had pie. Listen to me. My grandma had made some um, sweet potato pie. So I had pie. And then, oh, yes, I did. I had I only had drunk half of my green smoothie, then I had drunk the rest of it the next morning with the pie. I know. And then um here we are today. Oh my green juice today. So I'm gonna try to stay on there. I'm getting some type of greens in every single day. The way I'm eating this bird. <laughs> I'm hungry. So I know for today and tomorrow for dinner, I'm going to have chicken. I got green beans that I got from Trader Joe's before I had actually went out of town. Maybe some green beans. Y'all, I put it some, I did some green beans and I put some, um, that chili sauce that I got from Trader Joe's. I put it on top of that. A little salt, a little pepper, some good. Girl, I'm going to edit the vlog and see how far I get. It will go from there. But I do want to post today. Fingers crossed. Alright. I'm gonna call you back. Bye. Alright y'all. The pizza is done. This is all I got to take it out of the oven. And I sit it on the rack because I ain't got no like pizza pan. And guess what? Some cheese filled in the bottom of the uh, oven. Now I got to go get in there and get to scraping that out. Yeah. Alright. Let's see. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna let y'all lean a bit. 
Look at my little pizza. She is cute. I already turned the oven off and everything. Out of there. Well, let me pull it back out first. And maybe I should have my plate over here. Because it's all I got. Oh. Wait. That's not going to work. No, the cheese. The cheese is on the bottom of my thing. Touch your, touch the rack with your hand. Look at that cheese at the bottom. Out there formulated. Well, let me see y'all can see. Out there getting burned up. Just burned. Girl, like that. Okay. Alright. Got a cheese on that part. I'm gonna go ahead and lick that. I ain't even gonna hold it. Let me lean y'all up and back y'all up at the same time. <laughs> y'all got a washing machine going and a dryer going. I put a load of clothes in before I left to run errands today. And, um, tastes just like that dial. That's actually so good. Kids look up close and personal. Not them pepperonis. I mean, I guess. I'm gonna get the cut in it. And you're gonna try it out. Hold on. Okay, y'all. So I let my pizza cool down a bit. Now, I'm about to try it. Let me finish y'all looking at that piece. I'm about to try it. It's still kind of warm at the bottom. Just pick up one slice. I feel like the cheese is like. Mm -hmm. You know, like when you're biting something, that cheese gets stuck on the roof of your mouth. It's doing that. Let me try the the meatless pepperoni. It's pulling apart like cheese. Not really a fan of those. The cheese is just like a little, I don't know how to explain it. It's like, you know how when you're eating bread and the bread gets stuck on the roof of your tongue? That's what the cheese is doing. And I don't like that feeling. <laughs> but I'm about to eat this. Continue to watch this video until my videos download to my laptop. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Hello, good people. Oh, please back up. Hell wow. All right, y'all. I'm currently now. I just left out of Dollar Tree. I'm about to go inside of the UPS store. <clears throat> Cause me and my niece. I don't know why my voice sounds like so tired. I guess I'm tired of talking. Cause I did a lot of talking this weekend. Maybe my vocal is like, girl, please calm down. All we did was talk so much. I think that's the most talking I did it all year, honey. When I say I talk, baby girl, I talked. Um, so even like yesterday, my voice just been like this raspy, like. So I don't know, and I've been up for a while, but I ain't really talking to just now. I just been texting. But yeah, so I'm currently now at I'm about to go inside of the UPS store to send off this package to my grandmother because me and my niece have bought my grandmother these little shot glasses. Ever since we went on a cruise, I gave them, I left them with my niece because I knew they was going to my grandma's house and they would probably see her before I would see her. She took them all the way to my grandma's house, forgot to give it to her. 
So she gave it to me this weekend when we met my grandmother in Georgia. I took them to my uncle's house, drove them all the way here to Ohio. I said, uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. So I'm about to, girl, these little nubs. My, my little fingers, working in a warehouse, them little fingers be chew up, be chew uh, that's why I don't get my nails done because they be chewed up. I mean, I would like to get my nails done, but they be chewed up, Chad. So, right after I do this, I'm sorry, y'all. That might be coming off. Hold on. Yeah, so basically, I got this box from out of Dollar Tree. They was out there doing their stocking and all of that. I said, child, let me go ahead and grab me a little box while I'm at it because I was not about to pay for one. That's crazy to me if you had to. I thought I had a marker in here. Well, I guess I thought wrong. I'm gonna try to peel this little label off so nobody get it confused. My grandma gonna get it right here. I hope the box is big enough. Yeah. I wish I had something. Oh, perfect. I just bought some paper towels out of Dollar Tree. You know, just to have. I I I got them wrapped in like these little things. Well, they wrapped them for us. But maybe for like a little extra cushion because I could have got wrapping paper out of there, but girl, boo. or even some newspaper. Do I? I don't think I got newspaper in here either. Girl, reduce for use recycle. And hopefully, when my grandma get these paper towels, she use them on something to wipe down something, Chad. Yeah, look at that. Mm -hmm. It ain't charming, but it's soft on them, Jess. A lot of people keep coming out of this restaurant. It must be some good. It's a Thai restaurant. It must be some good. I wonder they got a little lunch special. I ain't never had a little Thai. Did I have a little Thai? I might look at that little menu. I am hungry. I need to clean this car out. It's, I'm baffled. Look at me. I'm trying to use bigger words, child. It might not be that big to y'all. It was a little... Upper room, girl. It was a little up there for me. All right, boom. We got that. So now let me run inside. Uh, hopefully, do I got my car? I think so. I'm gonna run inside of UPS real quick to take this in there. This look a hot mess. I wonder if do I have to have a label or can I write her address on the actual box? Wow, the way they went over that speed bump like it wasn't a speed bump. Let me call your baby. Yeah. All right, y'all. That was quick and that was easy. At first, he was like, it's going to be $35. Do your grandmother perhaps live in a small town? And I was like, yeah. And he was like, um, yeah, it's a little bit more because that means only one driver will have to drive like all the way out there. But um, y'all know my grandma live in the country, child. But my grandmother actually sent me her P.O. box. Being that I was able to uh, get it sent over to... Let me take y'all off this tripod because that's the issue here. Being that I'm um, sending it to her P.O. box, it actually only ended up being $8 versus $35. I was like, yeah. Y'all, I'm so embarrassed of how my car look right now. We got Duncan from Georgia. I'm in Ohio. We got Bucky's from Kentucky. I'm in Ohio. We got Kids McDonald's Crumbs from South Carolina. I'm in Ohio. <laughs> this stuff has got to go so yeah right now matter of fact let me do this real quick because I told my grandmother I would do it for her like ASAP like send her over a confirmation and my grandmother she I think I told y'all about this before she's a woman of her word if you say you're gonna do something you better do it so that's why I made sure this morning I put in my notes go to post office so I told my grandmother I would send it over um I would send it over to her what's today I told her, it's Wednesday, it's my Sabbath. I told her I would send it over to her today. So, yeah. All right, so we got that. Um, it don't have an arrival date. It's just, it'll get there. Oh, he said by Monday. He said, I would tell her latest Tuesday because what well, that man say Monday, my grandma go Monday and then she's going to be mad. I'm going to say, he said it will arrive at the latest 
Tuesday. He told me Monday, but I'm saying Tuesday. You know, just in case. All right, so that's the event. I'm gonna hold on to this. Now we're about to, real quick, go straight across the street to the car wash to wash this car. So I'll catch you guys once we get there. I can't wait to wash it out, vacuum it. Like, just get it right, cause it's not looking right. Let's see. I'm gonna call y'all back. Bye. Oh, we all off the curb. Perfect. Neutral. Okay, y'all, let me tell y'all this thing that I be doing. So, for the car wash thing, right? Oh, y'all not gonna be able to hear me, so I'm gonna have to tell y'all in a second. I'm gonna tell y'all after the car wash. Hold on. She got on Trader Joe's shirt, that's how I knew. All right, so real quick, let me get to vacuuming this car out, y'all, it's so bad. But let, this is what I was about to tell y'all. So I need to upgrade my my uh, car wash situation, but I asked him when I went up there, I was like, when y'all next deal? He told me it's next month, which is today is October 30th. Today is my best friend's birthday. Happy birthday, Courtney. Yesterday was the 29th. It was my niece's birthday, Journey. Happy birthday, happy belated birthday to Journey. And then tomorrow is my other niece's birthday, um, Aina. So happy birthday to Aina. Um, but yeah, so um, basically I was asking him, I was like, when the next car wash deal, was it car wash deal? Cause you know, they be having deals where you get like, half off or it can be like uh so many months you'll get this set price or whatever so he told me next month they doing half off on the two highest uh things so i was like bet next month that's when i will upgrade because you guys know in ohio like of course it'd be like snowing and stuff and all that your car just be looking real crazy okay so that's why i was like i need to upgrade and stop because i've been getting that little wash i'll be getting that little wash i need to go big i need to go big okay keep my car together and it's so crazy because this past weekend when i was at my uncle's house i was getting a lot of compliments on my car they was just like jasmine you had your car this long it still looks so good because i take care of my stuff and i ain't got no kids i ain't saying if you got kids you can't take care of your stuff but child y'all know how them kids do i can tell how them kids do look at my back seat you don't want to see it trust me you don't but let me get out here real quick vacuum this car out y'all don't want to see it y'all know what it look like to vacuum out of car amen i ain't gonna hold y'all i'm gonna call y'all right back but why do we get, keep getting so close? All right, y'all, I'm done with the vacuuming out. Now I'm about to, I forgot I, I, bought, I bought these for the house, but here we are in the car. You can do a little wiping. Um, so I'm about to actually use one of these wipes just to kind of wipe it down a bit. I don't know why, but I always neglect like this part up here when I clean my car out and I need to stop doing it, okay? I really do. So yeah. On these little wipes and kind of like wipe down everything. I'm hungry. I have yet to eat today. What time is it? 1.45. But that is good though. I okay, I went to work yesterday. I said I wasn't gonna go, but I did go. I said I'm gonna do it. I'm glad I did. So I did that. And then um I ended up actually getting off at 2:30. I got home and I went to sleep like maybe like well, don't lie. I went to McDonald's. And then I went home. Okay. So then I went to sleep. I can't remember what time I went to sleep. But it was early. And I ended up getting up before my alarm. I think I got up at like 11. I set an alarm to get up at 12. Um, so that way I can get like some stuff done. I wanted to edit a vlog and everything for you all. 
but I don't know what it is. I don't feel like editing. And nobody told me that tomorrow is October 31st. And I got all them Vlogtobers, or well, Gotober vlogs that I ain't even edit. And I'm hollering by, yeah, I'm glad I, I got videos on videos on videos. And I ain't posting every day because now I'm up ahead. But you ain't edit nothing. So that don't, that don't, that don't make, make your situation no better. Okay, at this point, you should have tried to do daily vlogs because you ain't edit nothing. You've been blogging, but you ain't been editing it. Uh, that's a problem. Okay, that's not okay. <laughs> so it's like, I need to, um, I need to for sure find time to edit. My goal is to edit two videos today and two videos tomorrow. That's a total of. Oh, I'm, I'm blurry here because they feel like you lying, Jazz. I'm sorry. I hate it out of y'all. But, um, that's my goal. That's my intentions. We're going to see what happens. Um, what's today? Today is Wednesday, so I don't have a workout today. I really don't have anything to do today but to edit. And, I mean, I did have a couple things to do. Like, go to the post office. Come get my car washed. Like, of course, I want to do these things as well. But, um... Yeah, and clean my car out, Lord. Thank God for the, yeah, it's what that stern wheel. I know it's just as dusty. And I had got maintenance done on my car before I left to go to Ohio. So, you got people in and out. Just, I just wipe. It looks so good, y'all. Just wiping her down. Ooh, I didn't realize how dusty you were. Yeah, we about to go into a new, a new month. So, let's, uh, look, I'm using it as an excuse. But, Hey, let's not go in a new month with some some stuff from the last month. So, I don't know what is this. Oh, it's coming up. It's like some sticky stuff on my little thing right here. But yeah, it just feels good to get in here and wipe it out. I had some flower seeds from left to right. Let me say that, okay? Girl, I did. I ain't gonna lie to you. I got it in and I sucked it up. So good. Yes, ma'am. I want to get a full, like, detailing on my car. Like, a full detail. See what that look like. See what that be like. I heard it can be a little on the expensive side. You ain't never had one before, and I'm sure it can use one. It can use a little detail eh? Jasmine. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to wipe off everything. Get that dash. Get that dash. Okay. Alright. Get them, them door handles and stuff too. Because them be nasty. Mm -hmm. the window things. Yeah. No. Alright. This car wash ain't getting out near bug juice on the front. But it is what it is. We gonna upgrade next month. Let's say that. We gonna upgrade next month. For this month, we gonna just do a little water and salt. Yes. We gonna upgrade it next month when the deal hit. We love a good deal. Okay. I'm backing out of here. This a little tight one right here. This little, this little washing thing. Oh, I came out so good. How we all gonna do this? Hold on, somebody got away. Her car looks so good. I wonder what type of wash she got. You need to wonder what type of seat belt you gonna put on today. I wanna go to, um, what's the car? Oh, I forgot. I think I'm about to hit. I don't know. Do I want something? I kind of want to drink, but then I kind of don't want to drink. I'm trying to see what I want. Y'all, my lunch for work yesterday was. Oops, sorry. Oh, my braids must be real good. Cause why did I? Why did it break like that? Anywho, I kind of want to call it, but then I, I don't. My, I don't think I want anything sugary. And. The reason why I want it because I woke up this morning and wanted it, but I feel like I waited too long to eat. Now I'm hungry and I actually want food. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's that's probably what it is. 
Oh my bad. Yeah. That's probably what it is. You got to give yourself a second or two to figure out what it is exactly that you'd be wanting to eat instead of going straight for that coffee. But the um, I w I will say this real quick. When I was at the car washes now. The little suck suction thing, it sucked my pants up a couple of times. And now I got like little spots in it. The ghetto. But yeah, I don't know if I want that or if I want to go to a smoothie king, which a smoothie king is nowhere near me. But then I say, no, I ain't going to go to smoothie king. I'm just buy some spinach and make my drink at the house. So what you about to do, Jess? I don't know. I haven't gotten that far in my thinking process. I might go get that kale salad from Chick-fil-A my mom be getting all the time. She says it's like a little small kale salad. Do you want that? I don't know. I need to find food. Let's go here, let's see. Let me go ahead back and I think about what's my next food. Bye. Okay, y'all, I'm back home. I'm preheating my oven so I can get that rotisserie chicken going because I was about to go get something to eat. And I was like, wait a minute, I got food at the house. Yeah, so, definitely about to eat at the house. So, but I'll show you guys everything. Everything that I got from Trader. Some spinach. I got the chicken and the pork dumplings. For a little snack when I need it. Okay. I've never tried this one. This, um... Fruit and vegetable wash, but I always want to try it. But every time I go in there, I forget to grab it. So I'm gonna try this out. Um, it's a fruit and vegetable wash. I just said that. Then I got my green juice because, yeah, greens every day, greens every day. And then I got some heavy whipping cream. Um, this is vegan, so it's you won't miss the dairy pretty much no dairy in here and then i got this pumpkin butter because i saw taja but she didn't use this she used the regular kind but y'all know how it go over here exactly pumpkin butter heavy whip boom and then she also talked about this body butter i think this was the one that she was talking about in her vlog this the only one i've seen that said trader joe's body butter so yeah i forgot to take a screenshot of it so I just assume, I'm gonna see what it's about. And if I don't like it, I'm still gonna use it, yeah. Okay. I know you could take anything back, but I feel like I'm gonna like it. Why can I not get it open? I don't know. Is it tape around this? No. Oh. Ooh, it's pretty thick thick in there. Why look how thick that is. It looks good. It's deep to the touch. Deep to the touch. Mm-hmm. That's deep. And got a nice little smell to it. It's like coconut something, child. Coconut body butter. I hope I don't have no effects up to this. I feel like the only time I ever have a really effect to coconut if I'm eating it. Like putting it in my body so we're gonna see what it's like this is thick on my body it says luxurious body butter made with coconut oil shea butter and vitamin e i'll let y'all know purify water cocos mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. yeah uh, okay yeah but it smells really good i like it okay so real quick I'm about to make me up some chicken, or me some chicken tacos. So I still got some of those. Uh, these are zero calorie. They say they're good by November third. We still got some time on. Thank you. Dad. So I'm about to eat that. One more day, rotisserie chicken. Eat that, and then um, edit a vlog, and then clean my bathroom. I did deep clean my bathroom. Well, I wouldn't consider deep clean, but I clean my bathroom today. Um, before I left the house, I got some laundry that I did yesterday, which I'm kind of glad I did that. Like, soon as I got home, I unpacked myself and put it, like, in the laundry. So, all my clothes are done. I just need to fold it, put up. I need to clean up my kitchen. And that's it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. But I'm going to edit my vlog first. Because it's about 3 o'clock and I would like to upload it at a decent time. So, I'm going to cry back. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> 
Girl, first of all, I'm super tired. Second of all, I did not know that my milk had expired September 20 something. So I'm like, that's weird because all of October, I feel like I was drinking on that milk. And it's been this spice since September. I don't even feel, I don't even feel like I bought it in September. I feel like I bought it in October. I'm gonna have to go back and look at the vlogs. So I guess I've been drinking this spice milk this whole time. And remember, y'all remember the milk? It's this one. I just poured it out, not so long ago. But it's this milk, and it's showing up. It says best is used by September 23rd, 2024. What? But yeah, you know, I went to the office. Yeah, and I got me some coffee. Um, but I don't have no milk. But I remember back in the day, my grandmother, she probably still do this. I'm pretty sure she does. But back in the day, she used to use this. I think it's carnation milk. It comes in like a can. And she used to use that inside of her uh, coffee. And she also used to use that when she used to make her macaroni, if I'm not mistaken. <sighs> Don't give me that. But yeah, so I got that. But what I thought about, I do have heavy whip. I did grab some caramel. Caramel syrup. Some sugar. And, oh, wait, I forgot. I have this too this i can use this i don't think i have enough oats to make my it's late jazz okay yeah and you got that baby my neighbor's got a baby <sighs> okay and i don't want to do that blender it's like yeah it's not 40 cents um maybe i could add some of this because this is a pumpkin or whatever so we'll add this i want to get my coffee a little cold i think i want to do an iced coffee yeah so let me put an ice cube in Oh wait, and I got I got dark roast. So if I put this ice cube in it, in here, it should be fine. Like it shouldn't be too watered down. I need a hair tie. It shouldn't be too watered down, y'all. When I say I sat on that couch, I sat on that couch. That girl be taking full throttle when it comes to that Wednesday, girl. I sat on that couch. I ain't did a thing. I ain't did a thing. But um, I'm gonna let this cool off uh, for just a second. So I'm put mad at it. Let's put it in the freezer. And then while it's in the freezer, we can go ahead and make our thing. Our um, what's it called? Our um, our I have to tell y'all something. So I remember reading it who was in Proverbs. I read somewhere in the Bible, and it was basically saying, "I'm gonna pull up the scripture so I can get it right." Hold on, matter of fact. Let me let me find the scripture. Okay, so there's two things. The first one is Proverbs 21 and 20. It says the wise store of, store of choice food and olive oil, but foods go up there down. So that was one thing I was thinking about. And it may not Oh wow, that scared me. It may not have much to do with what I'm thinking about. God Leah! It may not have much to do with what I'm thinking about, but I think it does at the same time. I think it does it. What the world? It do. So, what I was saying was, from the scripture, what I got from that scripture basically was, you know what I did? I didn't even tell y'all. I got so much to tell. I didn't even tell y'all. Okay, this this is some of the things I need to tell y'all. Okay, first thing, first thing from the scripture, what I got was store pure food. So I'm thinking about just looking. Pretty much I how my grandma, she always store up her food. She never make, like her fridge have something. Like there's going to be a meal or something. If a storm was to come today, my grandma got enough to eat for probably like three months. Because they, they got freezers on top of freezers. Like if I'm not mistaken, I think my grandma got two big deep freezers in her house. And then of course her fridge got a freezer on top of it. She stores up her food. So that kind of just made me think about like store up your food jazz. And it always... Makes me go back to think like, dog, like all those times, like when I wouldn't have food, I would just go out to eat, make it something quick, just go grab something to eat. But even if I just store little things, it will eventually pile up. That's why today I bought like, instead of one dinner, buy two, like those little frozen milk things, instead of one, buy two. Uh, when I get the meat, if I have extra meat, put it in the freezer. I got extra meat in the freezer. We ain't never done that before. Um, vegetables, try to have at least two vegetables in freezers. I got broccoli, I got a big thing of broccoli and I have a big thing of green beans. Um, and then like my fruits, frozen fruits, I got pineapples and I got, um, is it peaches or mangoes? Let me have I think it's peaches. 
because I had, yeah, it's peaches because I actually had peaches yesterday. I got two loaves of bread in the freezer. Like, it just, I don't know. And just now when I just opened my freezer to put my drink in there, it just made me smile because like, wow, you're doing it. You're doing it. Okay, real quick, let's do it for this. I'm gonna just use this mason glass so we can see what it looks like. Okay, so we got our glass here. Hopefully this is a good viewer, hopefully. So we got the um, Dairy Free Heavy Whip. We got this from Trader. I wonder if Taja, I think she put the pumpkin in first. Hold on. This, this is what we're gonna be using, the pumpkin butter and the heavy whipping cream, dairy free. Gonna pop that over just like that. Mm -hmm. I actually wanna taste it to see how it actually tastes. All right, so I don't know how much. I'm just gonna take about maybe that much. Hopefully that's not too much and put it in there. And hopefully it's enough. Then I'm gonna lick the spoon to see how. Uh oh, then I'm gonna lick the spoon to see how it tastes. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. And it's already sweet, so it's not. It's like you may not even need. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Jasmine. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm gonna put that on a little a piece of a piece of bread in the board if you ask. <laughs> now that's good. Put that on a piece of toast. Okay. Pour some of that in there. I don't know how much, but I think that should be bad enough. And let me get my whisk. Okay, battery still some good. I ain't utilize it in a while. And then you're supposed to just whisk, whisk it up. Oh, can y'all see that? It's changing colors now, Jasmine. <laughs> I probably should have had a smaller container because it's going to take a long time to travel to the top. And that means some stuff going to be left behind and I don't like that. Jasmine. I really don't. Okay. There was one person that won the Bible thing, but she never reached out. Let me taste it. Now that tastes good. I wish I'd been new about this, honey. Mm -hmm. Y'all see what that doing? Hold on, let me show y'all. Let's see what's going on, there. Period. Good. I'm glad y'all could see. Yeah. Now we got that. Now let me get another cup. I can hear y'all yelling. See, that's why she be having so many dishes. Okay, this is what I want to do. I want to take the creamer and I want to put it in here. And, and I'll explain why. So I already have some cream in here. Okay. Okay, boom. So I already have some cream in here and I will add, add some ice in here. Also add my coffee. Put this on there. And I may add like just a splash of this, probably not too much, but just a splash of this. So yeah, so let me lit the, oh, you did not have to do that, I did, I'm sorry. I'm gonna add some ice to here, and then we're gonna go ahead and add the coffee and the other things. Okay, so now we got our ice in there. That coffee still got some heat to it. <laughs> Is it real hot? No, it's not that bad actually. Go ahead and pour that coffee in there. Oh, Jasmine, you're awake. Oops. Pour the coffee in there. Wow. Hold on. Then, let me wipe this out more. I am bad old. You should be. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. So now I'm just gonna literally add just like a little splash of this because I don't want it to be too sweet. And I'm gonna have to go get some oat, some oat milk tomorrow. Boom, just a splash. Y'all saw that? I splashed it, amen. Now I'm gonna go on with my creamer. 
Oh wait. Let me show y'all from a different angle. Boom. Bada bang. Oh my god. Glad y'all can see some good. So boom. Now I'm just gonna add. Okay. I'm just gonna add this on top. That looking good, girl. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Y'all, seventh brew actually opens on I think if I'm not mistaken, November. Or number or November third. That's gonna be the first day that they open up. So yeah. All right. Now on top, I'm just gonna add just for design of the some cinnamon sugar, just a little bit, just for um looks on the top. Literally just for looks. Boom. That's it. Okay, hold on, hold on. Everybody be quiet. Everybody be quiet. It's so. Is it beautiful, guys? It is. Uh, right here at the crib. Right here, where? At the crib. Alright, so. Moment of truth. Alright, moment of truth. Let's see how it actually tastes. I wanna mix it. But then again, I don't. I want to taste it with the foam stuff on top first. So let's try it. That's nasty. <laughs> you got to mix it, Jazz. That is nasty. We know. Hold on. Why is that so? I don't know. Mix it. Okay. Cause that's not tasting good. Okay. It's still nasty. Mm -hmm. Still nasty. Oh my god. The coffee is so strong. Add some more heavy whip to it, Jazz. Okay, I am. Maybe add a pack of sugar. Oh, that's actually kind of cute. Look. See how the sugar... Mm. See how the sugar sitting in there? Isn't that a pleasant sight to see? <laughs> okay, so I added some more heavy wood and now I'm adding sugar. That's still nasty. I have been bamboozled. Maybe honestly, it's because I need some milk. Should I add more of this? Let's see. I mean, you can try it out, man. Ooh. At the end of the day, it's still nasty. This ain't even coffee no more. This is a milkshake, bro. Nasty. That's it. I ain't adding no more sugar to that. That is what that is. At least we tried. We'll try again tomorrow. Not today. Okay, so real quickly, what I'm about to do is wash my dishes, um, fold my clothes, watch a YouTube video while I'm doing it. Um, tomorrow is Thursday. Um, so I'm about to get ready to do Bible study literally right after I do all those things. For the book of Isaiah. Do I need to refrigerate this, for refrigerate this after opened? It say but as a pastry filling. This is good though. It don't say refrigerate at the open. Oh, it clearly says that at the very front. It says refrigerate at the open. I feel like once I get all the right ingredients, it'll be good. Because I wonder. If I do the coffee, do the milk, maybe add some pump, two pumps of vanilla, then do the foam on top. I think that'd be cute. I think that'd be cute, but this wasn't cute at all. But yeah, so that's that. We tried, and I had the caramel on the side. What if I add the caramel? At this point, I'm just playing in the kitchen. I'm adding it though. We just gonna see. 
if it'll make a difference in what we got going on. This is two pumps. I'm gonna put two pumps of caramel. Cause it, it's like it needs a sweetener somewhere. But the coffee I did use, I did go for dark roast. Cause I was thinking if I put the ice in there, it would not be as roasted. As far as the medium roast, it would dilute it a bit. Okay, let's just try it. I see where it's going. It needs syrup. I know you like wood. Don't knock that. Girl, I forgot I got this one. This is the caramel pecan. I forgot I had that. That's what it is. That's what it needs. It needs syrup. I feel jittery. I can't drink this whole thing. I'm gonna drink a little, hold on. That's what I needed. The syrup. I went there to get it. Okay. I'm not gonna drink all that because that's too, ooh, as we can see, y'all blurry. Y'all sleepy. I told my, my mom was like, are you? Okay, yeah. I was on the phone with my mama because they're going on a cruise. By the time this video's out, they'll be back. And I was caught, I was on the phone with them because I was checking on them to see if they made it to Orlando already. They did. She was like, are you tired? Are you sleeping? I'm like, I think I'm getting sick. Like, my voice been like this all day, really. Because I don't know. I think I might be getting a little sick. I don't want to claim it, yet. But, yeah, I just been kind of out of it today. So, tomorrow, what I need to do is... Is that a, oh girl, I thought it was a bug. It's lint. The dust from the ceiling. Jasmine. <laughs> but no, what I need to do tomorrow is make sure I get some stuff that I help uh, build my immune system. Like go to Ordis, get that orange juice that we, we know of. Get that orange juice. Um, probably try to get some supplements. I did see this lady, which I'm going to go back to Trader Joe's and get those. I saw this lady, she bought like four packs of these like supplement packs and they were like a dollar and some change. And she bought like two of one kind and two of the other kind. So she must know they some good. So I'm going to check, I'm going to check them out. They was over there where the uh, body butter was at and I noticed she picked them up. So I was like, hmm, I wonder what them about. But I'm going to wash these dishes. Clean up and everything. If I'm supposed to do y'all again tonight, then I'll catch y'all tomorrow. Girl.